what is the future of video games? I have no idea. But yeah, it's um, kind of impossible to know, but it isn't impossible to speculate, so let's do that. Indie games are impossible to speculate about, the reason being is that indie game devs don't have to actually pitch their idea to a big studio, but instead all they have to do is just ask a few friends, or even just start the project themselves and add more people along the way. So instead of focusing on the unspeculatable, I don't think that's a word, let's talk about AAA games. Slowly recent downfall of FPS games, which is pretty sad because it's pretty much my favorite genre. And it's not even the genre's fault at all, every genre is pretty oversaturated. More of the problems really come with studios nowadays, such as excessive crunches, time constraints, and deadlines, forcing devs to make a buggier and inferior experience which is sadly most known for the FPS genre as it's one of the most profitable, which makes it a big target for greedy marketing teams and game companies. But here's the speculating part. I'm gonna say that after indie games start making more amazing titles and AAA titles get even worse and worse, there's gonna be a resurgence in quality for AAA games as they're gonna realize that indie studios are starting to make better games than them. And this is one of the reasons why competition is good for the industry. And I wanna talk about something else um, before we go to the next topic, but sadly X Labs and also the SM2 mod has been shut down, which is pretty sad, honestly. And it's kind of stupid how they did that, but it's just an Activision thing. So I guess they just don't like their community, but let's just go back to this topic on hand. I think we're going to see more remasters slash remakes of older games, which is pretty good because they help franchises reach a larger audience, as well as look absolutely amazing. We're probably going to see some more genre mixes as well, which is basically when you try to mix two or more genres together, like combining an FPS shooter with a Soul Slide, which someone should absolutely do. That seems like absolute hell. Fun. And no, Doom Eternal is not a Souls like. Yes, not even close. If you guys enjoyed this video, then go drop a like. Or if you didn't, still drop a like, because dislikes are absolutely useless now. Okay, bye!